normal spot. I was thinking about that today, poking down there with some cattle and looking around and, and, and seeing uh, my granddaughter and one of them and um, my son and, and thinking of the, the family at home and what would be great if they were there. Uh, so, so, so sort of really to answer your question, it's one of the, one of the greatest moments of my life ever because I really never thought <coughs> we'd ever get back here. Or, or in, you know, so we've got our state forest license, but just to get back into Wanagata or into Wanagata for a start, because our cattle have never been, there's been no marriage cattle um, in Wanagata for over 100 years. So to achieve that with Charlie and John and, and um, our son and oh, look, the rest of them and, and Jeff and Kerry, it's, it's just, it's just magnificent.
John, cattle finally back on Wanangatta. Finally, yeah. How does that feel? Well, it's just, it's just magnificent, let's face it. I mean, it's something we never thought would happen, and it has. It's just terrific. Had, had you ever given up on the prospect of this occurring? Never, never ever. Always had uh, that hope that uh, we'd get them back in here eventually. Not so much back in here in Wanangatta, but back into our own high country. See, this is not our country that we ever ran cattle in. But it's, this, is, this government has given us a chance to get cattle back into the park, and this is as good a place as any to start. Why should they be here? Purely, purely to keep the country in its original state. It's far from its original state now. And uh, when the cattle were in here and grazed in here, this valley was just absolutely beautiful. And it's far from it now.